This is Ozaria. I'm currently working on the Python version of the course. Let's see what we're doing. Sometimes it's good to run the code first. Oh, I always do that. You should always do that. Not sometimes. You want to see what it is, what it does. As the program is running, follow each line, right? So we see these checks. It helps us figure out where there's a problem. Find and fix. Yep. So obviously move up would be what we want there, I think. And let's hit run. Boom. And see how it checks them off for us? Uh-oh. So this isn't showing an error because it's doing what we asked it to do. We say build a left arrow and then we move down. Once we move down, let's see what happens. We have nowhere to go, right? So let's see, what if I change this to up? And again, you can make changes see what happens be wrong a lot that's the great thing about coding it's so easy to make a change you can be wrong a ton okay so obviously i didn't want to keep going up there hmm well we got to get over here so i want to go up and ooh, what did we do on the last level we went up and to the right maybe this first arrow is right that will be a problem so this should probably be up arrow and then move up. Now, what if we do left arrow, which is good. I think we want it to go that way, but then I think we would want to move left. Let's try this out. Ooh, this is like last level. Oh, and I stopped though. Okay, well, let's try. Remember, this is gonna go two times, right? Zero to two, so zero this time, one, and then it, I would be equal to two now. Well, it already went through zero, one, so it went through two times. It's done. So let's see what happens again if this is three. Hmm. So guess what I'm going to do? What happens if this is four? Because notice we do the up arrow first, and then we do the left arrow. So if you walk through it, well, what if I did an up arrow here? and a left arrow. Looking good. Code always runs in order. And all this is doing is repeating. So we could have also written these four lines four times in a row, so 16 lines. That's what's great about loops. Let's keep going.